from Trollhatt in Sweden. Again, 20 years old, and imagine three days before <laughs> you get the call. Be careful what you wish for when you're manifesting your dreams. Well, Emil showed up at proving grounds and rode well enough to where he was in the top five, and people were dropping out of the invite list due to injuries. Antoine Bizet, G. Atherton. That's how Emil found himself here. I think this could be the start of something special here for this young freerider. First timer making the drive. Emil slowing down into the start drop. He's got the fast plan 360. The same trick we saw Cam Zink use to start his run. So things off to a great start here. A no foot can for Emil. Rhythm section here. No foot can into that inverted table. Now he's got a nose bomb feature on this rock. You have to be so precise for this to work. Let's check this out. See that rock there? He's planning to only touch that rock with his front wheel. Look at that. And now he has to really get on the brakes to slow down. So steep. So definitely demonstrating some of his tricks already. Demonstrating control in the steeps. And showing a unique approach to carving out a line on this slope. A toboggan on that step across. He's not letting any opportunities go to waste here. This is that big vertical drop that I was talking about. And he's going from the higher up option oh. with the suicide no-hander. Oh. So much style on that hip. Now what does Emil have on this trick jump? A back. Oh, oh yes. Going deep and holding the extension. That was dirty. Come on, man. Yes, the tuck no-hander. Wow. What a performance from the young gun newbie in his rookie appearance here at the 2019 Red Bull Rampage. Emil Johansson, I'd say he belongs. What do you guys think? That is a rookie run for the history books right there. <laughs> so much steam. So much style. I mean, he's going to be tired because yes, there's no yes, downtime in that entire oh, run. Oh, yes, yes, <laughs> You can imagine the emotion. And you talk about the crew being here in the desert for the week. When he has a run and it comes together, it comes together for everyone. Now, a guy who has won Joyride knows what it's like to be put on the spot, have the start gate. Operator say three, two, one, go. But at Rampage, it's so much different. Hitting something like that drop, I'm talking like close to 30 feet vertical there for that. And to get the trick off it, there's two different options on where to take off. You see, he's going off the option higher up, which is going to score higher. The judges have been walking around all week. They know there's two options up there. The amplitude on that further right option is way higher. But every time he was in the air, he was doing something, whether that's a stylistic flare or a big trick like this extended backflip one-footed can-can. Yeah, nothing to yeah. criticize in that run. <laughs> You wanted to get critical, but you can't. No, I was trying. <laughs> I'm looking for something. 